everybody and welcome to another edition of Lane Side Reviews. And on this episode, we're going to be looking at Brunswick's brand new Cutting Edge Solid. Alright guys, so welcome back. As always, I'm the Bearded Beast, Rob Johnson, joined once again by Scoops Porter. And as we said, we're looking at Brunswick's brand new Cutting Edge Solid. A solid ball that kind of reacts like a pearl ball used to? <laughs> so, uh, Brunswick released the original re-release of the Edge line last year, and it, it had a lot of fanfare. There was some good motion in them, but they wanted to create something that had a different motion for that line and what they came up with was the cutting edge solid and hybrid and um, both those balls hit exactly what they wanted which is a lot of down lane motion so why don't you tell us a little bit more about the ball scoops it has the melee jab core in it mm -hmm. but they changed the density of the core yeah they lowered the differential a little bit and raised the rg just so it wouldn't spin up so early yeah. giving it a little more pop down lane yeah and it has the 3C solid reactive cover stock. Okay. So what they actually did was, this is kind of cool, they took the LT48 and the classic black quantum cover. Yeah, the base cover the base stock. cover, yeah. yeah. And they tweaked it to create a hyper-reactive solid cover. Yeah, it, it comes off the spot <laughs> down lane yeah. like what we thought of the old pearls, pearls yeah. did, but it's a solid ball. And this ball is so strong, it's actually... Two and one stronger than the Deviate Turmoil Solid, but it's still flippy. Yeah. And if you compare it to the hybrid cutting edge, there's about a four and two difference between the two of them. But rather than listening to us talk about it, why don't we take it lane side and see how it's stacked up. All right, guys, here's Wayne Porter, our speed dominant player. He's bowling on the Phi house shot. Now, uh, as we said, this ball it has skid flip properties. Yes. Um, the more rotation that you have, the more it sees the friction, the more snap you're going to see. Yeah. So when we have Wayne here, he's playing it kind of on the edge, and you can see the more he throws it out to the friction, the more, the more it starts to hook. Yeah. The more it sees friction, uh, the harder it snaps. That's right. Um. It just kind of blew my mind that this was a, a skid flip ball. In a solid? In a solid. I just, I'm still trying to come to grips with this. Because <laughs> I love solid balls, and I'm not great on skid flip balls. Yep. So this one. Well, it's just because you don't like pearl. Yes. Well, this is like not wow. a pearl. But it's not a pearl. But it but acts, it acts like, like a pearl. So, <laughs> see, I'm very confused. But he, Wayne, is throwing this very well. Yes. Uh, he had a really easy time throwing this one. Yeah. Um, basically, it allowed him to play the friction rather than having to kind of play deeper Being, into the oil. Yeah. Um, now, here you come on it. Yeah. What do you think? <laughs> it, so was, it was not what I was expecting. Let's put it that way. Well, see, that first yeah. shot you threw, you kept yeah. in the oil. Yeah. And you're like, hmm, that, that's not that's Yeah, not this is not, yeah, this is not that bad. And then as I tend to get it a little... Wider. A little wider. You, you see. see. Boom. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, it did. It, it, it reads, because it's solid, it reads mm -hmm. the friction as soon as it sees it. Um, it doesn't necessarily, like, look at that. Yeah, for you, you're yeah. playing it more on the oil. I know yeah. that you said, for you, if you got it out too early. Yeah. Um, because it's skid flippy, it became yeah. a little too angular. Yeah. Um, so it allowed you to play a little more into the oil and then have miss room to the yeah, right. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, which is good. Yeah, I mean, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. I'd rather have miss room mm, than, you not know, miss room. Than, well, than <laughs> dumping it in the gutter either. Yeah, well, yeah. Yeah, I don't know if I could throw this ball in the gutter. I, I mean, I could <laughs> probably try, but, I mean, playing that oh, oil line. Oh, Yeah, and the carry is just beautiful. Now, as we said, the more rotation you see, the more reaction you're going to see, and here I am. And you can see here. Yeah. yeah. You can see how much angular it is. Yeah. Like, I was able to get around it a little bit more and take yeah. advantage of how flippy it is. Yeah. Um, where 
you know, in a solid ball. You can see I'm not wow. even I'm not even trying to get my hand under no. it. I'm almost flat wristed there, so I'm not really revving it. Yeah. I'm just allowing the ball to get to the friction. I'm yeah. making my break point about the five board down around the second cheater board. That's even deeper. And you can see I'm yeah. just allowing the friction to bring it to the pocket. Yeah. And this is the kind of thing that you want when the when they're starting to get fried in the mids, when you want that ball to get down, yeah, yeah. you want something that's going to be able to turn the corner. Exactly. And as I was kind of, I, I was the same as you. Ooh. <laughs> I was kind of conflicted because yeah. I thought, you know, how is a solid going to be that flippy? flippy? Yeah. But, you know, the Quantum, the LT48, they all had the same motion. It's really clean up front. And then when it sees it, boom. I like it. Yeah. Now we're going to give you a different view this time. Now check this out. Here we come with a lane level and mid level. So you can actually see how this ball, how fast this ball reacts when yeah. it sees the friction. Look at how friction. that ball comes over. Sweet. All right, guys, that about wraps it up for another show. If you like what you saw this episode and want to find out more, don't forget to follow us on Facebook at Lane Side Reviews or click below. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel or click on the box. Or and if you missed our last video or just want to watch it again, you can click on the other box. And don't forget you can pick up any of the jerseys you see in our videos by using this coupon code at LogoInfusion.com. So until next time, guys, we'll see you lane side.